It's been raining all weekend in Las Vegas, and I have been collecting rain for my plants. I've been collecting these buckets. I want to show you. I've dumped so many buckets. So many, I'm still in my pajamas. I have been running around in the backyard like a crazy woman, pouring the buckets, emptying them onto different trees. And as soon as I finish the front, I go to the middle, I go into the courtyard, and it's raining again. I mean, the buckets are full. Okay, look at this. I even have these little, my little popcorn plastic containers collecting water because I've run out of buckets. And look, look at this one. Look at this one. I, I strategically place these buckets where I know there's going to be some big drain off happening. But it has been raining nonstop. I'm going to show you in the backyard. In the backyard, there's a whole area that gets a lot of runoff of water. So we're going to go back there. I've dumped... I guess maybe three or four water, like the paint buckets at least in the last 24 hours. And then of course my daughter called me this morning and says, mom, and I'm, she's like, your, your water buckets are over spilling. I said, I know, I was praying. I was doing my Bible reading. And, but look, look at this. Let me turn this around. Okay, it's like a symphony. So we've got this little rain bucket and I've dumped this several times. I even have the little dog bowl, this bucket this paint bucket. I just carried it out. This whole thing, I was so freaking heavy. I carried it out and I just take it and I spread it out through through my garden. Look at this. I know what it is. I, I love my garden and when it rains, especially being in Las Vegas, I just feel like this is my time to collect the water, to give, to feed nature. It's, it's a purpose. <laughs> it's a purpose, the garden giving my garden love, giving my garden water. <laughs> I don't know, I'm, I'm pretty happy. I, it's, it's been raining a lot and I like the sunshine. I, I need the sunshine when I'm filming and doing my work, I need the sunshine, but this is beautiful. I'm, I'm really kind of liking all this rain. Listen to this, listen to the rain, listen to the rain. So beautiful. It's actually too rainy for me to, well, actually, let me see. I'm gonna take you over here, because look, look at the, my greenhouse when you're inside. There's nothing more beautiful than listening to rain hitting on a roof. Okay, listen to this. Listen to this. Okay, listen. It's hitting, the rain's hitting. Can you hear it? I love it. I love it. Okay, I look like a drowned rat. I need to go inside and I haven't even had my tea yet. And it's, God, it's almost 11 o'clock. Beautiful start to your week. Happy Monday. Stay dry, stay warm. I've got a water band. That's what this is. It's a water symphony. I just looked back out my window and I'm getting a little nervous, you guys. Look at my pool fill. It is really starting to fill up. And you can see, if I come over here, look at this. This is where the drain is, and it's at the top of the drain. I'm a little worried that this pool is going to overflow. We're supposed to have rain for the next three days, so I am not sure what to do. I think I've seen people put sandbags, but I don't want to go to that extreme, but any advice? So any of you who have ever experienced a Noah's Ark kind of rain, which is kind of what it feels like now, and you're, you've had issue with your pool and it flooding into the yard or into the house because it comes, the level is right at my patio. Anyway, any advice would be great.